Welcome back everyone to another episode of Two Can Plays. This week we are going to play Forza Horizon 5. Specifically, we're going to play the Hot Wheels uh, expansion pack. I kind of turned Tuesdays into Hot Wheels Tuesday. <laughs> Alright, so let's continue on where we left off. Come on, I'll need your help. So, where's our special guest? The Hot Wheels expert. <laughs> Haven't figured it out yet, have you? Get in. Okay. All right, so we're going to... It looks like we're trading in our Skeletor hot rod for this this, place. this car, <laughs> just for this race. Come true. I thought I'd bring along a few friends who wanted to show off their Hot Wheels inspired cars. Aww. So, I've got some fact sheets here. You get to learn along with the audience. I'll just hit the record button and... I've never guessed, Haley. Big Biz Meekin, the biggest Hot Wheels <laughs> expert on Earth, is about to take you to school. Uh, okay. It all started with Elliot Handler, who saw the toy cars his son played with and thought to himself, I could make something better. You see, right from the very beginning, Elliot envisioned a toy car that looked cool and rolled fast, making it that much more fun to play with. At the time, there was nothing out there like that. Handler brought in former rocket engineer Jack Ryan and General Motors car designer Harry Bradley for help. And between them, they made the first 16 cars, known as the original 16. Jack's team developed the stainless steel axles and delving hubs that allowed the cars to roll super fast, while Harry made them look super eye-catching. Harry and Jack's contributions became the pillars of Hot Wheels, performance and design. The first car off the production line was a custom Camaro, and not like the one you're driving right now. See what you did there? Yeah! And another of the original 16 was the custom Fleetside, based on Harry's custom Chevy El Camino. Most of those early designs were inspired by hot rods and muscle cars, which were popular in California car culture at the time. After Harry Bradley, more designers joined the team, like Ira Gilson from Chrysler, who did the Twin Mill, and Larry Wood from Ford, who designed the original Bone Shaker. But right from the beginning, they were designing cars to do one thing above all, roll really, really fast on plastic tracks. You've done your research. Oh my research. gosh. I memorized this stuff when I was six years oh old. Oh my gosh. One reason why Hot Wheels are so eye-catching is because of a special paint called Spectra Flame. They use a transparent lacquer applied over a polished zinc plating, which gave it a totally awesome metallic effect, just like a real car. Since then, Hot Wheels has broadened and developed its paint techniques to support a variety of looks and effects. Fascinating stuff, right? Another detail was the red stripe on the tires, like the one you're driving now. They called them red line tires, and they look so cool. Redline tires are a defining characteristic of this era and are really sought after by collectors. Alrighty then. <laughs> Sounded like she was reading the Wikipedia page or something off of Hot Wheels. Uh, but, you know, it was interesting information. And this track is so cool. I just love the graphics in this game. It is so awesome. Ooh, slow down. Slow down. There we go. I don't know, it wasn't much of a race though, those other cars, I haven't seen hide nor hair of them. And I think we're about done. There we go, nice yep. Drive. Here, take the Nash Custom 1957, winner of the Legends Tour 2019. Okay. Thanks, Haley. Hey, let's do this again soon. Sweet, so we got a new car. Let's check it out. Two stars. Oh, come on. I love those guys in the dust. Okay, so this is the new car. Ah, the dragon. I like this new car. I'm not sure if I'm so hot on the, the baby blue or the teal color that this is. We I just love the tracks in this game. It is so cool. The booster. There we go. <laughs> Let's see if we can get a different paint job for this car, though, shall we? Yeah, I mean, it looks nice, the teal, but yeah, let's, let's see what else we got here. Okay, so we've got what, pink, we got red. Ooh, I like that one. That looks like a hot rod. That's kind of nice. Ooh, this taxi looks kind of fun, too. I like the candy red, too, in the 50th anniversary. That looks nice. But you know what? I think I'm going to go with this hot rod design. This one looks cool. Do me a favor, though, before we get going, be sure to smash that subscribe button if you haven't done so already. And please hit the like button if you've been enjoying this video. It really does help these videos get out to more people. Let's me know I'm doing a good job and that you want to see more of them. Wow, check that paint job out. I really like that. That's awesome. 
<laughs> oh. I, I got to say, I do enjoy in Forza Horizon 5 the features that allow you to really check out your car. That car looks so super sweet, dude. Okay, so it says we need to start off here in the middle of the map, and then we need to go to... Uh, it said Hammer Mountain. There it is right there. And there's a dragon at Hammer Turn Mountain. Around, safe to do so. And we got to get there in 3 minutes, 15 seconds. Let's see if we can get there. That is our next task. Here we go. There it is way out there in the distance. Ooh, what are these, like, fans? Ooh, they're blowing me and making me faster. That's cool. Yeah. Hard charger. Okay. I like how they just throw points at you all the time, too. That's kind of fun. Okay, I got 40 seconds to get to the dragon. I think we can do it. Come on, come on. There he is. 27 seconds. We got this. Hello, Mr. Dragon. Nice. Okay, new Hot Wheels qualifier unlocked. LA Cools, oh. you're ready for the next qualifier. Don't want to keep her waiting. Oh, sweet. Okay, so maybe we get faster cars now? Uh, okay. Complete this, and I'll upgrade your rank to pro. I'll let Alejandro know you're uh, on the way. Oh, okay, okay. So we got to finish this next mission, and then we can unlock faster cars. Sweet. Hey, well, let's get out there. Let's do it. <laughs> There's those blowers pushing me super fast again. Okay, so it looks like there's other players playing as well. Maybe? I don't know. I can't really tell if they're online with me or not. I like the radio DJ too. He's kind of fun. What's this? Dude! Okay, there's water. It's like a... It's like if you turn on the hose on a, on a Hot Wheels track. That's so cool. <laughs> That's awesome. The effect is super cool, especially at night. That's really nice. Okay, let's get this. Hey, Lisa, she's always wanted to see what this thing can do on this scale. So for that, I think we need to take it surfing. For your Surfing? next qualifier, you'll need to prove you can take on the water flumes at high speed. Let's go. All right, let's do it. Okay, so we're using a Diora hey, now. Remember, surfing is all about balance. So it looks like some of the races, they, they force you to use a certain First truck or a certain car. Right That's okay. Nice. This is fun. Oh, I like the water effect, too, on the camera. Does this car even have one? Does it roll down? Head straight on here. We'll take the speed boost to the top and skip the queue. Nice. Yeah, just the, the graphics are just so awesome in this game. It's just cool. It's peaceful, you know? Out here in the rainforest. Okay, next boom coming right up. Remember, you want to move with the water, not against it. With the water, not against it? Okay. So there's no competition and this looks like this looks like it's just a a time trial. And I think I have to get there within two minutes and I'm about to lose that. I'm not gonna get it. Oh, I did! Ah, that was amazing! Looks like you 
looks like you're going back to school at the academy. You're a pro rank now. Oh, you can keep the Diora. Nice. Okay, cool. I did. I just made it under two two minutes. That's awesome. <laughs> made it through the qualifier. You are now officially an academy pro. I've added all the new events to your schedule. Something tells me you're gonna love these. How would you like to learn a bit more about Hot Wheels? Awesome! Want to learn about the famous orange track? Absolutely! Okay! We're, well, we're gonna have to save all of these other events for the next episode. Thank you all for joining me. I really do appreciate you watching these videos. Be sure to check out this video you see on the screen right now, and we'll see you on the flip side. Later!